Holy moly, guys. It is here. Thank you, GMR11, for loving my videos. Awesome. Okay, but it is here, guys. Clans. The official release where we have all been waiting for. It is here. Let's go outside and let's explore the world. Um, so this is our clan. I know it's awesome. It's the best base ever. You can never get into that. It's just like the shit is lit. Holy moly. Let's just run to the shops. Like my claimants were finally that smart to live close to the shops. Which is really nice. And oh I shouldn't have flashed. Is that still there that... I'm, yes, I am unsafe. Okay, I will wait in the corner. But there's so much new stuff. And I want to go through all of that new stuff. That, like, I don't know if you guys have seen the trailer. I will put the link to the trailer from the Mindplex Games channel in the description down below. Because you gotta watch that shit. It is epic. So, I have the complete change log or update log right here on my second screen. And it says, buckle up folks, this is a big one. Yep, a really big. Clans release. We are taking the beta tag off of clans. This doesn't mean that clans won't get more updates or futures in the future. But we finally have most of the original concepts in the game that we are happy with calling it a full game now. To celebrate... Celebrate? To celebrate this, we are resetting the clans worlds. Great, awesome, perfect. And beginning a whole new season of clans. And so am I. So um, I'm going to start a new playlist. And I want to do daily clans videos for the upcoming week or two weeks. Yes. Oh, I'm going to make one new playlist for the full clans release. And we are going to make so much videos in that. And I want to start today. And this is basically going to be an update video. And I will do a second video later on this day. Where like the real first episode of clans is going to begin. So let's continue the change log. But what's a reset without a boatload of new futures and bugs? And yes, it is a boatload. Holy shit. Okay, full clans change log. New freshly generated world. That's awesome. Great. Clan specific hub. Clans.mindplex.com. Oh, I guess that's... Oh, that's an IP. So you can join clans directly. Oh, that's nice. Okay. And they added the new boss arena. I'm so excited for that. And like half an hour ago, there was a clans um there spawned a boss right um somewhere in this map and I, we, my clan was about to go to it and they all locked off but there was a reset they don't know what like they reset it or there was a box on i don't know probably the boss arena spawned in wrong something like that but they reset the clans and we all to rejoin and the boss was gone so yeah i was about to go to a boss um, the boss arena randomly spawns around the map. Clans can challenge and defeat the bosses too that wait within. Defeat bosses have, the defeated bosses have a chance to drop gold tokens, prefixed gear and legendary. Their death also rips a portal to the nether that lasts for 10 minutes. Whoop, oh my god, nether. It's also in the trailer, you should check that out. Okay. Edit, Iron Wizard Boss. A mighty wizard who uses earth magic to crush his foes. And that's basically an Iron Golem, if you have seen the trailer. And then the Skeleton King Boss. The Skeleton King is a fear wars. What is a fear? Is a fierce warrior, and his horde is possibly even more terrifying, which you could see in the pictures I post on my clan's update dominate video, where that was the uh, wither skeleton with surrounded in the uh, dead warriors and archers with that wand. Edit the nether. The first version of the nether is a dangerous place. It can only be accessed when the portals are open. Monsters in the nether can drop ancient runes. That's also new. The only place they can be found. Edit ancient runes. Ancient runes are a re remnants of an ancient power. Long lost to time. They can be used to give prefixes or suffixes to any weapon or gear, including legendaries. Woo! Okay, I will move to another location because this is just boring. So you guys can see a little bit more of the shop. I think they removed the lake here. Because there used to be a lake. Or a small little pond. Okay, let's just stand over here. So you guys can see the old shops. And it's a little bit more interesting to watch. Okay. Legendaries can now be prefixed, suffixed. Legendaries have a 35% chance to drop with a prefix slash suffix. And can have additional ones added with ancient runes. So I guess we'll find out about those ancient runes another day later on. They added clans banners, which is not too interesting because you have to purchase them from the shop. Which is probably nobody gonna do. Well, probably some people, but I'm not. Um, a new clans only cosmetic item. Can, clan leaders can purchase an added kit from the store. This will give them the ability to create a custom banner for their clan. They can then choose to wear them or plant them in the ground to taunt their enemies. Clan members can purchase the ability to wear but not edit them. Invasions changed to sieges. That is a big change. 
because players no longer gain full block access to enemy clans when they reach 25 war points. TNT protection is now permanently enabled unless until someone hits 25 war points. So basically you can store your legendaries a bit better because you can break blocks now. Which is great. And you can break chests, which my clan mates always used to do. And then all the stuff these spawned around. Like, why the hell would you do that? Okay, now we continue. TNT price reduced from 30k to 20k. That's a big change. And TNT cannon price reduced from 50k to 25k. That's a gigantic change. And outpost price reduced from 100k to 30k. That is a gigantic, massively changing impact on the game. Probably. Currency no longer transfers between servers, okay. Fixed lightning orb duplication bug, okay. Fixed warpoint evasion through slash kill, okay. Removed undead camp. Wait, undead cities? Did I remove the undead camps? What? Hope not so. Okay, and then there's a champions update, which I'm not too interested in, except for five strikes because that got a gigantic nerf. I guess that's basically all this update has to bring and basically all it is a lot. So um, I already got a kill. I was running around as a brood having a lot of fun. And one of our truest friends just was there like two people and I guess one of their allies as well. And their allies started, started attacking me. I did nothing because we are truest. Well not with that guy but he started attacking me. He shot me with a bow. I did absolutely nothing. He did a little bit of damage. I was like okay. I just ran back to shops and then somebody in the shops attacked me and I just completely wrecked him. He brought me down to 4 health and I just 3 hit him. He was an assassin so he just died. And he had a ton of stuff on him but especially assassin armor which I love. And I didn't purchase because it's so expensive. And he had a diamond sword. Because you can convert 1000 gems into 16,000 gold which is not that much. Like you can't even get a diamond sword. Which yeah that's 9000 but then you get barely anything since everything is so expensive. So now I do have a diamond sword. I would love to have a golden axe but... We just started off, so it will all happen pretty soon, I guess. So this is basically all I wanted to tell you guys in this video. Just a quick little update of what's going to happen. So I want to do daily clans videos. I love playing clans. You guys love watching clans. So I want to do a lot of clans videos, basically. Where we are just going through the whole updates, doing boss fights, going to the nether, doing whatever is possible in clans and we just want to make daily videos if possible so this is just going to be a quick update video about clans and then i will like later on the day i will upload like the real first episode so i hope you guys are really excited for that and as i said i will put the trailer link to clans in the description down below so you can check everything out for yourself because it is pretty cool um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, leave a like and subscribe to more stuff. And I hope you are excited for the new clan season. Goodbye.